Hello everyone, this is Daniel, hope you're doing well, and in this video I wanted to take a look at the GT530 graphics card. This is an old graphics card, I think it's 2011, might be 2010, but it works fine for getting accelerated video output in Adobe After Effects. It has all the ports you need really, it supports two monitors. You can modify it for low profile, so if you go ahead and unplug this port here you can remove the VGA port and the IO shield and it becomes a low profile graphics card which is nice if you have a machine like a small form factor Dell Optiplex it's not a fast graphics card, it's rated at, I think, 500, where the GTX 1050 is rated at 4,500, so 10 times as slow as the GTX 1050, so definitely not recommended for gaming, but it is a lot better than the video integrated graphics that come on this i7 CPU of the second gen, where basically it's a lot better than having integrated graphics because the ports you have DVI output and you have VGA output and you have HDMI output so you have all the digital and HDMI outputs all the digital and analog outputs you need um, again it supports two monitors and that's about it it powers itself it doesn't need any extra pins which is nice otherwise you could go with a old GTX 440 or 550 or GT 550 um, but at that point you probably just want to get a real graphics card so yeah that's about it um, works great thanks for watching hope this helps